Okay, so welcome back and let's go into putting automation on your building. So you, you don't have to monitor every single time you can have your software build or your bot build your castle automatically. So in this case here, if you go into setting and under building tab, this is the type of settings that you can actually put on. So here I got it on auto build, which means basically it's going to build and is um, automatically without you having to interrupt it at all. Now, uh, with this particular one, you can click on lowest level, which means basically it's going to go through low level buildings before it goes up to the next level. And then you can ignore spam bot. Um, I can actually set one like this as a spam building for you to, when they send a command for you to build to press help, um, you can designate one of these buildings as a spam building which means that your bot is not going to maximize that building it's going to keep it at a certain level and just keep uh, using it as spam building uh, which is very helpful during guild fest and such or filling up your help bars for your guild coins this does make it ignore spam bot next option here building priority what do you want to focus on first so here i have it on their trading post because if this is a farm, obviously I want trading post to be as high as possible. So that way it can send more RSS each with each um, cart. So I have it set, but you have option to focus it on castle, which means it's just going to go through all the ones that's necessary for the castle level. So if I do this, this is the quickest way to bring your castle level up to 25. Uh, most of the time what I usually do is I will maybe bring it up to 16 before I turn it into purple and then after that time I'll decide it really depends on what type of castle you're building if you're building farms then you do need to focus on trading posts and your resource buildings so in case of like resource buildings you have you can have resource down here which includes all the RSS buildings plus your mainer since mainer produce gold uh, you can also focus on academy which will help you on doing further researches you can just focus strictly on manor or barracks and infirmary monster hole familiars trading posts uh, resource with no manor it just basically focuses on your rss without focusing on manor so it will skip manors and then treasure trove and workshop and any other wait any other options there most of the time, again, I will focus on castle to bring it up to 16. But since I'm trying to test something here, uh, what I am going to do with this is I want a trading post. Since this is very low level castle, I need a trading post to happen. So I will go ahead and save it. Um, now, another option here. If you scroll down, you notice it's empty. Um, these are chapters like this one right here. I have option to set what type of building I want there. So do I want Manor, Barracks, or Infirmary? Right now, I will just call this one Manor. And then next one, I may want one more Infirmary and one more Barracks. And I will go Manor all the way. And if I don't put anything, the um, bot will not build anything there. And then RSS spots, I can do Farm here. If this is a food farm, then that's what I would do all the way through. And then let's say next section, same thing, Manor or Infirmary. Uh, you can also set here on the monster hold once it gets to a certain level. Let's say I want a spring and maybe spire and a gym and a gym right here. And of course you want to fill it all up but right now for demonstration purposes this is how would you how you would set up everything and i'm going to go ahead and save and hopefully uh if we go to again that was under settings building right uh, another thing you do want to check when you do buildings is go to under generals tab and do you want to use speed up for buildings if you don't it's just going to build and uh, wait for natural time to pass by but if you did not, you can speed it up by using speed ups and putting smart speed uh, pretty much takes it right up to the point, but it does not exceed 
uh, up to free speed. But if I take it off, it's going to get it to a point where it can just use up speed and just finish the building right away without having to uh, go to free speed. So those are the options you do want to check. And now on top tab, you'll see building. This is current state of your castle. So if I click on it, you can see castle wall is getting built to level five here. Uh, eventually you want the software to, it does take a couple minutes to recognize it, but you want the software to recognize uh, your setting and maybe put up a trading post there so we can demonstrate uh, supplying resources and things like that. So we will come back to uh, that portion of the video uh, when the Mainer gets built or trading post gets built. So uh, again, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys on the next video.